G'day and welcome to the Lost Colony Hey! Well, scenario as Capac drives off with one of the trucks already. Yeah. <laughs> so Capac and I have actually played a little bit of the Lost Colony scenario on stream before, but we never managed to finish it. And with Survival Unlikely taking a short break while we work on the final episodes, we thought it might be good to come back to it. And hopefully maybe after this scenario is finished, we might get, even get some time to look at some community-made scenarios too. Assuming we can get them to work. Which has been a little bit awkward lately. But, uh, I believe we need to search for Hiroko Zhang. Who? Do you not see that GPS marker? No. Oh. Well, follow me then. Yep, lead the way. Way is being led. Oh, I do love the voxel hand work that went into this scenario. It's absolutely... Awesome. Uh, I see flames up ahead. Flames? Yeah. It doesn't bode well. Oh, maybe they're having a barbecue. Ever the optimist. Oh, I'm just hungry. <laughs> yeah, I don't think they're having a barbecue. Well, if they are, it's a really intense barbecue. Yeah, I... How much of when we played this before can you remember? Because I can't remember much, and I feel like I didn't pay a lot of attention to the story that was going on. I remember where all the best loot is. Of course you do. I can't open this door. Aha. Uh -huh. I have found some things. I found the toilet. Good. I guess. I have some data pads. Uh, I found some empty lockers. Uh, important, Hiroko Zhang to AGI extraction team. They are coming for me, so I don't have much time. The situation of the colony has gone from, gone completely out of control. My wife has the data you are looking for, but she's dead now and down in the morgue at the building with the data. Dead? Yeah, his wife is dead. That's the chief researcher quarantined the morgue from the research lab. The problem is that parts of the town, including the research labs, are locked off due to power shortage. It's the band of saboteurs. Uh, what about this one? In order to get the data off this forsaken colony, you have to reactivate the reactor to gain full access to the town. The reactor control room should have a reactor maintenance manual in a locker. It shouldn't be too hard to repair the reactor, though you may want to build a base of operations somewhere to manufacture the required components. This old prospector camp would work nicely as a base. This is a prospector camp? I guess? Yeah, I guess they were like looking in the hills for gold or something. Ours Did you look in your truck to see where whether there were any tools in there? There's gold in them our hills. Uh, doesn't look like it. No. Ah, there we go. Ooh, uh, gun. There is... Yeah, you got the rifle. Uh, oh, extraction team orders. That's all I need. We lost contact with our team in the Sunset Valley region. Your orders are to investigate the situation and make sense of what happened. We have provided you with the last known location of Hiroko Zhang, our liaison in the region who managed to send a distress signal. We haven't been able to contact anyone in the Sunset Valley. Situation is unknown. Okay, that was the thing we were supposed to read at the start. <laughs> I have a grinder. I'm going to open this door. Hey, I can see something. Ooh, uh, that's what, real see? Weird. Is that's real weird. It's like a bubble and a bridge. And some fences. Huh? It looks Is like the a bubble castle. A shield. Could be. So this base has a somewhat damaged basic assembler, survival kit, and basic refinery. So if we can find some more bits around the place, we can probably get this place up and running. Uh, what bits do we need? A fair bit of a few things. Uh, can we get the, the survival kit up and running? Uh, we could. We'd have to take out the one that's on this truck, though. Oh. And I feel like that's probably not what we want to do. Oh, well, just yet. maybe we just keep going and see what we find. Yeah. Uh, did either of these have a GPS marker? That one did not. This one does. Here we go. Lee, do you want to lead because my truck has the respawn? 
Uh, no, because I don't have the GPS. I don't have a GPS anymore either. But how do we know where we're going? Uh, there's a road? Alright, follow the road. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Oh yeah, let's go. Yeehaw! Ooh. Please be careful, at least a little bit. Uh oh. What? We got a fork in the road. Uh, which of the three directions are you gonna take? Uh. Forwards. Okay. Oh. Oh. Uh, no Some entry. Kind of. Well, I never let something like that stop me. Okay. Whoop. Hmm. I can't get in. Thought you never let something like that stop you. Hmm. There's a door over here. Uh. Whoa! Whoa! There's also a turret down there! Yeah. <laughs> I can see it from the truck. I don't know why it's not shooting at us back here. You appear to be shooting the ground in front of you. There we go. Uh. Uh. Wrong with your hands. What? There's nothing wrong with my hands. Your your arms just seem a bit stretchy. Same to you, bub. <laughs> Should we go? down there, or do you want me to grind our way into the building? Uh, we should probably have a little bit of a scout, see if we can see any more guns. Alright. We don't have much ammunition, so hopefully we can get some from that gun we shot. Well, maybe we should go down to that gun and reload first. That's what I'm doing. I'm just giving everything else a wide berth. Alright, cover me. Oh, what is that? Uh, that is... Slime? Some weird yellow stuff coming out of the building. Well, there's another blast door down here. Uh, I now have 11 magazines. Ah. Oh. Yeah, I've got 15 bullets left. Yes, most of your bullets went into the dirt. I saw that. Hey. That dirt was looking at me funny. Anything up there that you can see? No. From there? Nope. Uh, that door's off. Should we try and get into the building? Yes, so. Alright, well, I'll head up back to the trucks and I'll drop a few of my um, magazines yeah. in the truck for you. We probably don't want to carry all of our ammo on us. I don't like the look of this slime. It's got weird things growing out of it. Uh, maybe carry four magazines on you? I'm carrying 15 bullets. Yeah, I've just put seven magazines in the truck. So you could collect four magazines from there. Oh, connect four. That's a good game. Collect! Would you go get the ammunition and put it in the truck? What are you doing? I was thinking about playing connect four. <sighs> okay, don't see any guns in this room. There are some armor lockers. Uh, oh. Anything useful? There's, There's a drill a for you. Drill. Guess I could take that. Yeah, uh, this door is tools. open. Uh, There's a refinery in this room. The other side of this door. Well, this is the other side of that blast door. Anything in here? I don't think I can see. <laughs> Welp. <laughs> it's clearly a turret in here. Apparently. <laughs> you died in an interesting pose. I usually do. <laughs> Can you see? You got any stuff? Well, I have no idea where the gun was. Neither do I. Alright, maybe we take a different approach. There's another open door down here. Alright. Let's have a look. That leads oh, this is that 
other side of that door that looks into the refinery. The refinery intact? Oh, what is... No. Oh, and there's some iron and nickel. Oh, yeah? And We don't cobalt. really have any means to process them, though. Oh, there's processed stuff. Let's bring that. I mean, I could... I could start hacking through walls, but I worry that that's going to end up putting us in a bad spot. Well, that, that just goes to that blocked door here, so we might... Cut through this door that goes into the refinery bit, because it, I think, uh, goes to where that control room was. Where are you? Upstairs. Uh, cut, cut through this door. Which door? The one down here that goes to the control room. Oh. If we can take control of things, we won't have to destroy everything. Maybe. Maybe not. So destructive. Ooh, reactor components. Oh, access denied. And uraniums. Here you go. I'll make it so you can get in. Right, you keep watch and I'll see what I can find in the computer. There you go, hacking complete. Uh, let's see. Transfer to me. Okay, we've got hangar door A and B. How many turrets B. can you see in the menu? Uh, batteries, bathrooms, containers. Two. See, two interior turrets. Yeah. All right. You reckon that outside one was one of these, or do no? You... I've ground it down completely, so it's gone. Ah, uh, okay. There are two to be found. Uh, I don't seem to have a. Don't seem to have a control. Oh, hang on. What if we ground through these doors? That's where the gun is. Yeah, I know. Or do you want to go through the roof and see if we can spot it? We just throw capax at the problem. Oh. Anything down there? Uh, it looks the like that's a bit. refinery. Yeah, keep. What? Where are you going? What? what do you want to open. Do? We haven't been in there. Whoop. And then there's a turret, and it kills him. I don't see one. And a med kit. Oh, good. That's actually oh. somewhat useful. Hold on, I've got a view of the. I've got a view of the hangar. It looks like the gun's up on the roof. Okay. Where? Um... Can you see any of the holes that I dug? Okay, you know there? that the first hole that you did? Yeah. Uh, if you keep going... Uh... Let's see, one, two, three? So if you can out one, two, three blocks along from that one, like further down the building, you should oh, be right above the gun. That's all in the rock bit. Oh. Like I can drill through it, but I think we should probably use a different tactic because that's a bit cheesy. Uh, well, let me see if there's anything else I can do in here. Oh, this thing's on fire. Oh, hold on. There's a... There's a... There's a door back here that leads to some tunnels. Come back. Did you try turning off the base when you were in that control seat? No. Hmm. I suspect that might work. Uh, well, you could give it a go if you want. I'm kind of trapped in here. What are you shooting at? What are you shooting at? Shooting at the gun. Did you get it? Yep. Nice. Crisis averted. <laughs> now, if only... Get up there, which I can't. Uh, I'm gonna need to... I got some stones. Good job. And some metal grids. Ah, oh, that could actually be useful. And a bouton. I think I just turned a basic assembler on. Yeah. And oh, another got some more ammo. Drill. Oh, I found a data pad. Barry McKenzie. Please, please don't do anything stupid. Just let me handle the investigation. Vaughn brothers are far more dangerous than you think. Please don't try anything stupid, please. That's a lot of pleases. Uh, I created a GPS marker. Oh, I found a big old mining machine. Bertram Vaughn. While excavating tunnels, miners detected a sinkhole. I ordered them to leave the area alone because I think we may have found an actual entrance to one of those old bunkers right here in our mine. How do you think we should should proceed? 
give bonus vacation to the mining crew and hire someone else to help us silently excavate and explore? Maybe our newest miner, Alexi. He lives alone and is expendable. GPS buried bunker. I presume it's down here somewhere. I have given you the GPS if you want to use that thing that I just shared. Uh, buried bunker. Oh, it's below me. Okay. Down the hill we go. But where, where, Hank, where are you going? I'm driving Don't go down this me. tunnel. Don't leave without me. Got a big old mining machine. Kappa, get back here. Look. I spotted the treasure first. Let me get on. Where are you? I'm right with you. Oh, all right. I guess you can... Wait, can I even get on it? There we go. Uh, oh, well done. Oh, this looks like a mess. Yeah. You may want to walk. Alright. What is going on? Oh, turret! On? What? Behind you. <laughs> well. Guess I'm outside again. Uh... Oh, geez. I'll grab your stuff. That's yeah, fine. I'll be stuff. back in a sec. Where are you? I was at the back of the truck. Oh, there you are. You know there's a gun down between where you just ran around. That's yeah. where you got shot from. Your where rifle's in the gun? back of the truck, in the connector. You're rude. Grab the bullets that I left in there for you. Yep, we got it. Alright, let's go. Reckon there might be another one on the other side. Uh, it's possible. How'd you get down there so far? You I jumped. jumped. I'm at the buried bunker, but there's just sand. Well, and there's something under the sand. There's a ladder down here. Okay. Uh, I'll try and provide covering fire for when you pop through the hole unexpectedly. Looks like this place has been buried for a while. Uh, I'm at the bottom. Hmm. Wait. Hmm. Indeed. This place still has power. Oh, that's not good. I don't yeah. think we found this place in the when we played before, do you? Or did we? I don't remember. I don't know. I'm not liking all this green stuff. Oh, oh! There's a gun up on the roof. In that bigger room in front of me? Yeah. <laughs> One of your feet's in the ground and you're being spun around by it. Kind of funny. This way. This way. Alright, got the turret. Ah, oh, what the? What? I just died. <laughs> what the hell? No reason. Dropping down the same place I dropped before. Ah, you got unlucky this time. Yeah, I saw missiles and some ores in those boxes. Oh. <laughs> Did you get a look at where the turret is? Yeah, it's on the roof again. <laughs> oh! Okay, I shouldn't have laughed so much. There's a... Is there even a... Oh, there is a window there. Uh, we should be able to get a good eye... Good angle at this turret. 
quite easily. Uh, carefully grab your staff, and then I'll show you. See? Yeah. So, if I grind this window, and you're ready to shoot... You ready? Yep. Can you shoot it? Nope. There we go. Platinum. More platinum. Gold. Uranium. Hmm. I think I've escaped. Some refined silver, uranium, and gold. Uh, that seems to be all that's here. Can you see anything else? Nope. Alright. Did you see any data pads anywhere? Nope. Stop pushing me around. You stop pushing me around. <laughs> I just had to say it because you always say it to me. Alright, so that's the hidden bunker. Where do we go now? Well, there's another vehicle here and a door. Oh, this is down the bottom. Ah. Uh. So, we've got three vehicles and there are two of us. Guess we gotta combine two of the vehicles into one super vehicle. Uh, yeah. That's kind of what I was actually getting at, weirdly. Because then we can take one and... Oh, actually... What? My smaller vehicle, what if I just connected it with the connector? Yeah, that's what I was, I was thinking that might be the way to get it to be a super vehicle. Uh, let me get this one out of the way. Oh. Uh, I put some I put some stuff in the back of that mining vehicle. Should we try and get it out? Guess we could. There's still a turret somewhere in there that we didn't find as well. Just get back down here and retrieve my caterpillar. Which drives like a dream. Uh, just hold up there. I want to watch this. <laughs> okay. My caterpillar is assembled. I have done things to the rear set of wheels so that I will hopefully be able to control it somewhat. Alright, where are we going next? Uh, let's head back to that base and see if we've collected enough materials to put together the assembler and the refinery. This is so awkward. Uh, it's fine. <laughs> I mean, it's hard to move, but it's fine. <laughs> I, I'm, I'm torn between staying behind you to watch this symphony of stupidity you've got going on, or tearing past you because I can move more easily but than you this can. This is a perfectly normal situation. <laughs> I honestly don't know what I'd prefer to do. Yeah, maybe that'll be better. W what have you done? I reconnected it. <laughs> nah, that's probably worse. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hold up. Um, go back. I have an idea. Yeah, we're almost there. What if you increase... So, disconnect your connector. Never. Uh, and then increase the magnet magnet strength. And then it'll have a little bit of flex. Yeah. So, unlock your connector. Now, go into the connector in your menu. Uh. You don't have your parking brake on this. Long, did you? No. Go into your connector and increase the strength. I did. What did you increase it to? A thousand. Your connector? Yeah. Yeah. Because now there's a little bit of flex. It can actually be used as a bit of a hitch. There is. No, don't don't relock it. Just increase the strength and drive with it unlocked. Uh, it's working fine now. Actually, it's working real well. I can even steer. Oh. Doesn't like going up this hill, though. Come on. You can do it. Go, go, go. I need a horn. Ah, there we go. Great. Because you stopped me there, I'm now struggling. Ah. I had momentum. That's what you get for being impatient. What? That makes no sense. <laughs> makes perfect sense. Well, this thing has lots of cargo space. So, I'll probably hang on to this one. 
And I guess I might bust down this little wimpy one. Yeah, don't run me over. How rude. Oh, except I don't have a grinder. No, you don't. Uh, so, let's just have a look. Do you really want to get rid of the little one that's the most nimble? Yeah, this other one's not, not too bad. Okay. Does this one have a survival kit on it, or is it without survival kit? It doesn't. Um, okay. So, I need to get the assembler up and running, so that I can make you some tools. Yeah. Basic assembler. I need some motors, some displays, some, some com a whole lot of computers. Uh. I've made you a welder and grinder. What? Well, I tried to make a grinder and it was saying that it was make it, but it wasn't doing anything. That's because it's broken. The survival kit on the truck. The one I'm talking about. This truck, there are tools in there for you. Uh huh. We can now set about making this base useful for us. It's raining. What? Oh no, there's lightning too. Oh no. That, that's genuinely bad. We should take shelter. Uh, we need to build a decoy or an antenna somewhere to as it act as a lightning rod. Doesn't this place have an antenna? It doesn't look like it. Hmm. What do we need for an antenna? Radio communication components. Pipes and stuff. Uh, we should put an antenna on each of our vehicles as well, I think. What about a beacon? Will a beacon work? No. A beacon would have antenna components, right? Yes. Yeah, you can. You could do a decoy as well if you wanted instead. Putting an antenna on our survival kit vehicle. Don't know if it's a good thing or a bad thing to do it. Uh, that, yeah, that seems like a horrible idea. Well, at least... So my thinking is, at worst, that antenna gets destroyed. Because hopefully it won't destroy the rest of the vehicle. But if we're out driving around, this one isn't going to protect us, is it? Also, who puts a lightning rod horizontal? I couldn't find a way to get it to stand up. <laughs> I love that you agree enough with me to just say that you couldn't do it, rather than say that it's fine. There we go. Oh. Well. Oh, what? The rain stopped. <laughs> yeah, it's... They, they can come back, so it's probably not bad that we have it set up anyway. What you doing, Kavak? I uh, just built a decoy where the beacon used to be. Ah, good call. So, uh, we've got our vehicles ready. We got our. You've got tools now. Shall we move on and explore something else around here? I guess we could do that. Oh, we need a new door because you stole our door. That I did. Up into the hills. Aha. Uh -huh. Oh, um, um, this one. Uh, the middle? Oh, right. Oh yeah, there's like a house or something up here. Oh, there's a sign here. What does it say? I don't quite read it. The text is tiny. Kaufman Medicals. Ooh. Hey, this... Place was pressurized. And always when Capac is involved, was pressurized. Oh, it's only got one door, there was no way not to depressurize it. New message from contract office. I got an extra delivery request from the medical center. If you have any extra supplies, could you deliver them to me ASAP? It sounds like it's pretty urgent. Oh, and don't mind the contract description. We are having some issues with our systems. Ludmila Stasho. That's something. I got a med kit. Uh, I got a thing here too. Um, yeah. it says... Uh, from Teresa Kaufman. Uh, Belinda? Could you please deliver our packet to the contract office when you come back home? You can keep the payment. We're going on a hiking trip with Holloway and attempting to climb to Pioneer's Peak. This could take us a few days, so could you watch out for the house in the meantime? And it's got GPS coordinates to the Holloway Farm. Okay. 
I guess we head to the farm then. Uh, was there anything else over in the garage? Well, there's this swanky medical vehicle. A little ambulance. An ambulance. Ambulance. Ah, uh, no, I didn't see anything else in here. What about this door? I didn't see the door. Ice. Oh. Oh, medical components. Got some gold? Well, uh, do you want to leave the ambulance here or are you going to grind it down? What are you going to do? Uh, we could leave it here for now, I guess. Oh, that farm's pretty far away, though. One yeah. and a half kilometers. Doesn't so, look like it's got much of value on it. We just leave it here? Yeah, we could just leave it here for now. We know where it is if we need it. Sure. Alright, you lead the way as night falls. Uh, we're heading down to that farm. Yeah. Ow! Why do you keep doing that? You keep getting in my way. <laughs> You're worse than the guys on Top Gear. Oh, I think I can see the farm. Yep. Hmm. Another vehicle? Some kind of field? I'm inside the house. Uh, there's a ladder around here. I'm gonna see if there's anything up on the roof. Okay. Oh, found a... some canvas and a Leroy Holloway PDA. Hey, gotta say, there's somebody I'm... creeping around in the kitchen of this house. <sighs> oh, gotta say, I'm you. damn lucky the turret was offline. Otherwise, I would have been shut down long before I bumped into it. I'm starting to see why they tell people not to enter those old bunkers. And I just waltz straight inside like an idiot. Lucky idiot, but still. Nevertheless, it was totally worth it. Gold and silver to last me a lifetime. If I Ooh. fix the turret, I'll have a nice vault for myself. Maybe build my a nice farmstead nearby for easy access to the vault. I have the GPS for a small bunker that Leroy found. Ah. Uh -huh. Leroy Jenkins. I thought you were going to say Leroy's Bunker. No, that, that doesn't sound right. Uh, well, you've got the GPS, so Lido the way -o. Is there anything of value on this truck, or is it... Eh, it's nah, pretty really. average. Ah! I ran into what? a bush. What did the bush do to you? Got in my way. Here we go. Huh? This is the bunker. I don't see anything. You don't see this hole in the ground. Oh. Mmm. Oh. A forbidding, forbidden cave. Uh, remember he mentioned turrets. Yeah, there's just a door down here. Well, let's grind our way through then. Ah, uh, it's, it's already through. Oh, fine. Yep, there's a turret. Oh, yep. Is it active? Yes. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, never change, Capac. Never change. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, what a mysterious mystery. Indeed, but uh, at least we got some silver and gold, because uh, maybe we'll need them. Yeah, when we get off this planet, so we'll be rich. Well, there was... <laughs> what is that? But there was also the thing I read earlier that said we m would need to repair a um, reactor. And uh, a lot okay. of reactor components will require silver. Where do you want to go now? No, we don't don't have a new marker. No. We could go left. Oh. Sure. <laughs> Make it so. <laughs> it's a dead end. Uh they've probably done that intentionally. <laughs> to uh scare us off the trail. Mm-hmm. Mm that Weird shielded castle is tantalizing. Alright, let's head down there. 
Did we have we been to that building up on the left there? Was that the one that we went to before? Yeah, I think so. Oh yeah, it is. There's more road past it though. Oh. Well, I'm already headed for the castle. Well, uh, I guess we're splitting up. Well, can't just change your mind. Of course I can. Oh, there's heaps of stuff down here. There's heaps of stuff here. There's even more. There's another junction. Oh, fine. I'm coming back. Oh, found a building. Let's see, always spoiling my fun. Making me go on a perilous off-road journey. <laughs> Only perilous because of your driving. I'm a good driver's. Whoa! <laughs> well. Uh, what happened? Yeah, it's all good. Did you deliberately say, I'm a good driver, knowing that you're about to do something stupid? Nope. That's just the way it happened. What Eek. the? Cabin in the woods? Yeah. Now you're just trying to creep me out. Maybe. Oh, this isn't spooky at all. Nope. Not at all. Uh, I'm going on the roof. Nobody ever gets murdered on the roof. <laughs> oh, a big door in the side of the mountain here that's got a red sign on it that says trespassers will be shot. Oh, uh, I found a Billy Woodworth PDA. Oh, well, what's he got to say for himself? Old Billy still gots it. Made me a nice and profitable deal with them Vaughn brothers off them silver ingots. I already don't he knows like this better guy. Than to trust him, no. Installed a nice and new automated turret in my cave. Them try to get them ingots without paying, and they got more holes in them than me teeth. We have a GPS to the Vaughn Brothers. Iron, nickel, and cobalt. Uh, okay. Guess we just got this mystery... Nothing hole. in the front room? No, I got it. Okay. Alright, uh, drop what you don't need to carry in your truck. Uh, I've hardly got anything. Yeah, but have you got something valuable? Nope. Well, fine then. Uh, I guess I got some, like, platinum and gold and stuff. Yeah, drop it in the truck. Alright, here goes. Yeah, okay, I see containers. It is a turret, oh. remember. Yep, I see it. Okay. Oh, that looks like flame. Oh, 50 golds. And some gold ore. Mm -hmm. Nice. Uh, Anything else? I think that's it. Unless there's something back around here. Nope. No. Just his secret gold stash. Alright. Uh, whoa! Did you, did you just hear a gun? Yeah. Where? Oh. What? Where? Where is shooting what? Sounds like it's outside. Um. I, I just heard another shot. What is going on? I told you this place was haunted. It, it clearly is. No, oh. I, don't, I don't see anything up in the hills behind the house. Have you found something? No. I'm still hearing the plinkings. Occasionally. Wait, there's damage to this building on this side. Is there a gun in that... Did you not explore this whole building? Uh, maybe not.
It looks like there's an upper floor or something. Oh yeah, there, there's more. How do we get to it? What Whoa. the? Did you see the bullets? It sounded like they were coming from up in the hills. Yeah. Uh, this just looks like it's a vent of some kind. Ah. Yep. Oh, I saw those bullets landing near you. I think they're coming from this direction. What the... Still don't see anything. <laughs> it's just... This is bizarre. Oh! Was that you shooting? Nope. I didn't hear anything. I heard another random gunshot. Do you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna get back in my truck, and I'm gonna drive around with it. Because at least in it, I don't die instantly. I get hit. Man, I'm so confused. It's very confusing. That is also the end of the road. How can we not... We don't find the turret. And, uh, I'm trying to get its attention, but it's not shooting at me. Yeah, I know. I was hoping in the truck I'd draw more fire. Uh, should we leave this haunted place and just ignore it? Yeah, let's just get out of here. There was another branch in this road a little ways back. We could go down there and see what's there. Leadeth the wayeth. Okay. That was so weird, that turret. I, I'm so weirded out by that. I have no idea what was going on there. Haunted. Called it. <laughs> well, cabin in the woods. Being haunted. It's kind of a bit cliche, isn't it? Oh. Let's go like Oh, hello. Huh? Building. Up ahead. Oh. I see. You want to go first, because I've got the survival kit? Sure. Oh! <laughs> Is that a cliff on the other side? Maybe. <laughs> and there's a gun in the garage. <laughs> oh, man. I'm so glad I sent you first. Why didn't it shoot me until I got out? I don't know. Are you having respawn issues? Uh, possibly. Right. That's right. You just loot everything while I log back in again. I haven't do been doing anything when you're logged out. I just wait for yeah, you to come back. Likely story. I'm editing this. Why do I need to rush? I just... I want you to be in the thing the whole time. Very believable. Well, it, it is. Because you know full well that I do everything I do for the video. Don't listen to him, folks. That is always my highest priority. He deliberately edits it to make it look like he's getting the best of me. That's not true. Uh-huh. It's all smoke and mirrors. Uh-huh. Oh. Right, I got my stuff. Uh. Ooh, this car's... Whoa, it's all gold! Super fancy car! Bling car. Uh, that's just a door to outside. An armory with a gun in it. Uh, this place does have a, uh, a fancy rifle in it somewhere. Oh, do you remember that? No, I could see it in the, uh, in the inventory. Yeah. Bunch of space bucks. Oh, very nice uh, dining suite. Got a very impressive view. 
computers. Yeah, some swanky man lived up here. I uh, got some clan cola. Oh, we've got silver. I should have made us better tools back at the base. Um. Oh yeah. Uh, I just got some stuff. Ooh, and I got a precise rifle. Nice. Yeah, that's the one I was talking about. Uh, right. What PDA? What did it say? Freddy Reese. This place is getting mess really messed up in here, and not even thanks to me this time. People are behaving really weird. Not remembering what they're doing, and worse yet, they don't even care why they can't remember things. Gotta get my stuff and get out of here. GPS to Freddy's treasure cave. Ooh, treasure cave. Yeah. That's my favorite kind of cave. I, I know. Alright, you ready to head off? Uh, yeah, just doing a little exploring. Yeah, I don't see anything else of interest around here. Okay, dope. Although, there is a road down in the valley there that's headed, headed off between the mountains. Was this the road you were talking about? Yeah. Oh, yep, there's something up here. Hey. I... Under construction, what is this place? O2 generator, hydrogen engine, nectar. Turned on a hydrogen engine. Oh, uh, Victor Kozlov, some money, some cobalt. I don't need to take gravel. Uh, I'm just worried about your health. You are? From Mira. I feel fine. We are not young anymore, and there have been many more and more people coming to the medical center for checkups lately. I'm a bit worried about the symptoms too. People having memory loss issues and feeling apathetic. Ring Sounds any bells? pretty normal to me. <laughs> it's probably just stress from trying to build a family business while working on another job, but could you at least consider putting out a contract for getting the tank built? Love you. Oh, What'd you get? I got a an a superior welder. Oh, nice. Ow. What'd you hurt yourself on? You. <laughs> what? So there's some kind of contract to build this tank? Uh, they were looking for, a, trying to get a contractor to do it. Yeah, it's going to take a fair amount of stuff to build all this. Yeah, I don't think we need to build it. This does appear to be the end of the road. It does. Uh. This is the end of the road, Galvatron. Shall we head back to our base and then head to the bubble? Sure. Oh, wait, no, we should head to the Freddy's treasure. Uh, sure. Oh. Freddy's treasure appears to be in that farm plot. Really? Yes. That seems... Odd. Oh no, it's not. It's behind it. Ooh! Got some speed up there. Is this the farm we were at before? No. I don't think so. Well, shall I read a complaint form from Rashad and Nadia Han? Sure. We, Rashad and Nadia Han, would like to make the following complaints. Harassment and theft. Jared and Rita Cobb have been falsely accusing us of selling them tampered fertilizer. We did we did sell them fertilizer, but there was nothing wrong with it. To make things worse, they stole some of our farming equipment. When their foolish fight against the Weaver family didn't do anything but paint all of us to look like ungrateful whiners, they clearly thought they could cash in on a quick scam and disappear. I now have the GPSs to the Cobb and Hahn families. Fine. Oh man, this is starting to sound like those jerks on Dantooine. Sure. Hmm, there's a bridge down there. Oh, let's continue on and head for the treasure, I guess. I'm gonna go check out the bridge. You're not gonna head out the treasure? There could be a troll under the bridge. Trolls have treasure. Treasure! Whoa. It ah. is a deep ravine. Oh good, the uh, bridge is the way to the treasure. Told you so. 
You said nothing of the sort. Just mind the trolls. So we go, here's Freddy's treasure cave. Uh -huh. Oh, there's a dude in there. What? A dude? A dead dude. Oh. Is that Freddy? Freddy! Are you alright, Freddy? He's not answering. Uh, there's a PD oh, you're gonna read those? Cool. Damn it hurts. How did I forget those damn turrets? Damn it, got me pretty bad. Wasn't really expecting to bleed out after being shot by my own turrets, damn it. Well. <sighs> Got it. Oh, there's another one. No. Oh. You got it? Yep. Oh boy. <laughs> yep, you almost got yourself on that one. Yeah, I kind of hopped, skipped, and bounced. And I couldn't um, stop myself from bouncing. Oh. Yep. Gold and silver and missiles and ooh, a zone chip. I just got an elite hand drill. What is a zone chip? Uh, that is for the big bubble shield that you saw down the valley. Oh. You need zone chips to run those things. Alright, All right. so GPSs that I can turn off. Don't need Freddy's, don't need the small bunker. I don't really care about the farms at the moment. Alright, where are we going, Capac? Uh, I think this might be the easiest way to get back up. Oh, looks like another one of those farms. I have totally lost track of you. Well, do I have to come back there and rescue you? No, I went back the way we came because I figured that was the easiest way to get up. Well, you were wrong. Well, no, it worked exactly. Just lost track of you in the process. I'm on the edge of the bubble. Oh, you're on that side. I'm on the other side of it. Yeah. Hey! Quit it! <laughs> Alright, we're, safe zone. we're headed back to base. Uh, yeah. Let's head back to base and drop off what we got. And then we'll explore this place. Uh, which one is our base? Ow! Is it the one up there that's on fire? Yeah. Sorry, I actually didn't mean to run into you then. Yeah, likely story. Wait. What's this place? Have been here? Dunno. Must have. Oh, that train's a bit rough. No. I think I'm somewhere we haven't been yet. Well, I am back home. I am at a place with a greenhouse. Ooh. With grow lights. Interesting. And Klein Cola. Ooh, delicious. Bring me some back. Okay. Arturo Abbott. Message from K33PO. Okay. I know what you are doing with your Clang Cola. It's clever, but anyone who has tasted actual Clang Cola will find it watered down. You have a pretty nice business going on, so consider me your partner. You can leave my share, 60%, every first day of the month in your ice cave. As long as business goes smoothly and I get my share, everyone will be happy. Mm. Uh, that sounds like there's some shenanigans going on. Yep. Clang Cola manufacturing process. Ingredients, Clang Cola, ice from secret ice cave, homegrown spices, finely ground gravel. Grind what? the gravel and spices into fine dust, add the dust into a vat containing the Clang Cola, add the ice into the mix, profit. I Gravel? The... Yeah. I have the GPS for the ice cave. Uh, GPS for ice cave. Yeah, so I'll come home. And we can go to the ice cave, I guess. Ah, uh, there we go. Now we can live in comfort. I have pressurized the living quarters. You know the atmosphere is breathable, right? Yeah. But you never know when it might not be. We probably should do should travel this way a bit more often. So if we find another vehicle, we can just bring it back. So you can get us both killed at once, you mean? Well, I mean, you could... Oops. 
You can drive. That's <laughs> fine. Just try not to hit any trees. <laughs> oh, but I like hitting trees. It's the one thing I do well. What the? We're here already? Yep. Charge! Oh, jeez. Oh. I got some space bucks. And some ice. And some more ice. You ah! Found... I was gonna say, have you found anything? Where have you gone? Uh, I went the other way. I think... What the... Okay. Huh? This is serious... This is haunted. I am seeing ricochets coming off the rock. And that there's Over nothing here. here that could be shooting us. There's got to be an underground turret or something that's like shooting through the voxels. Did you drill right down from the surface? No. That hole was already there. Yep. Yeah, I think I fell down it last time. Oh. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I can't see any guns. Yeah. No idea what we're being shot by. Uh. Yeah, the boxes over here are on, like, a little platform, but there's no gun or anything. This is bizarre. Absolutely bizarre. This is truly haunted. It sure is. Alright, let's, let's head back to base. Now that I know the place is haunted, I think it's time for us to take a rest. Whoa! Help! What'd you do? Big shot. Alright, you drive. Uh, I don't know where home is. Alright. Don't just start driving off. There you go. It'll be fine. I've sent you the GPS. Nope. I don't have time. A little bit to the right. Too far. Left. There you go. Oof. Felt just sure you were going to end up in that mine hole. There we go. Perfect. <sighs> okay, back. I think we've made a bit of progress so far. Yep. I don't think we're that much... Like... I don't think there's that much more to do before we're into stuff we really haven't done before. Mm-hmm. I'm, I'm really excited to see the end of this scenario. Because it's been one of those things that's been kind of bugging me for a while. So, we will be coming back to this very, very soon. You gotta pick a bed. Uh... We got four beds. Which bed do you want? Um... I want the one with the best view. Uh... Which I think is this one. Job. Sure. I'm in the other one. Let's see Mars. Well, Capac, you have a nice sleep. Next time we will come back and we will explore that little bubble. So there's all that and plenty more to come. And we will see you then. See you next time, everybody. Whoa, whoa. Yeah. Let's see. Well, <laughs> there's clearly a turret in here. Apparently. <laughs> Behind you. <sighs> Whoa. <laughs> Alright, got the turret. Oh, what the? Oh. <laughs> Is it active? Yes. <laughs> uh, maybe. And there's a gun in the garage. <laughs> Never change, Capac. Never change. <laughs>